I'd like to take a moment today and discuss our specialty movement category. This group has a number of rather unique clock movements. We start with our continuous sweep movements. These movements have a second hand that moves constantly or continuously. There is no ticking every second, so all of the continuous sweep movements are virtually silent. Perfect for clocks in a bedroom or a reading room. Our 31-day calendar movements give normal time. They operate an hour, minute, and second hand, but they also have a fourth hand that just after midnight will flip to the next day of the month. Very, very traditional type of movement. And then we move to our tide movements. Our tide movements, they're based on a lunar day of 24 hours and 50 minutes. And then after that, we also have time and tide and then thermometer movements, as well as electric movements. Uh, many, many of our battery-operated movements can be changed over to electric that will run on the wall current of 110 volts. This is a reverse time movement, also called a barbershop movement or a barbershop clock. If you were to look at that dial in a mirror, it would appear to be perfectly normal. Whereas if you look at it dead on, you're out definitely going backwards. Uh, the next category is trigger movements. These are two wire trigger movements that are used to trigger a chime or some type of sound device on the hour. And next is our rotary pendulum drive. This is typically used in an anniversary clock. They often have big glass domes covering them. Our 24 hour movements are just that. They share time in 24 hour or military time. So the minute hand does a normal rotation every hour, but the hour hand does one revolution every 24 hours or every day. Last is our time and day of the week movement. This is quite a unique part because it actually will show you the days of the week. This is Mike Brossman for ClockParts.com. If you have questions, please give us a call at 888-827-2387 or you can also email us. Just go to the Contact Us section of our website, shoot us an email, and if you like, send some pictures along of what you're having a problem with or what you're looking for. We'll be glad to help.